Hi, my name is Matt Davis. I'm a uh, field applications engineer with TE Connectivity. We're here at Design DesignCon uh, 2012 in Santa Clara, and we're here showing some of our optical technologies in the booth. And what we're showing uh, on the left here is uh, our optical mod our midboard optical module technologies. What we have here is a live demo with a 12-channel uh, TX midboard optical module and a 12-channel RX midboard optical module. And the demo consists of uh, 12 channels of 10 gigabit traffic coming to the the TX optical module. The module does an electrical to optical conversion, transmits the data at 850 nanometer down a ribbon fiber through a connector and it's looped back on itself back around to the receive module that does the optical to electrical electrical to con electrical conversion and then the 10 gigabit data is presented to the perimeter SMA uh, connectors on the eval board and I've picked off one differential output pair and presented it to the scope. Now on the right side here we're, we're demonstrating some of our, our laminated fiber capabilities. What we can do is we can accommodate thousands of fibers in any pattern. So what that allows you to do is do uh, optical, optical shuffles um, it, and uh, optical cross connects and, and implement optical backplanes in a tray or in any sort of environment. So what we've done here is we've utilized uh, uh, 12 fibers in a loopback mode for the, the left side of the demo, but what we're showing on the right side here is an optical cross connect or an optical shuffle where we have 12, uh, uh, 12 channel terminations on one side connecting to each of the 12 channels on the other side. So for example, channel one in this position here goes to channel one in this position and the 12th fiber in the first position goes to the 12th position on the far side. It's called an optical shuffle. And then the last thing we're demonstrating here is our uh, TELME connector system. And TELME stands for TE Lens to Multi-Fiber Interconnect. And what it is is a non-contact optical interface that utilizes um, expanded beam technology. And what it allows, it, it uh, uh, the, the connector uh, eliminates the need to polish the connector as is needed in the MT terminations and it's insensitive to dust and, and particulates and, it, and most importantly it enables optical backplanes. So our second demonstration is on the right here. It's a passive demonstration. It's a mock-up of a, a networking box with uh, several vertical line cards. And what we're showing is some of our existing products, which consist of, of active products, including a QSCP Plus uh, optical transceiver, uh, compliant with uh, 40 gig Ethernet SR4. We're also showing some of our active optical cable uh, cables. Uh, this particular product is compliant or, or compatible with the FDR InfiniBand, as well as the 40 gig Ethernet uh, SR4 standard. We're also showing uh, a variety of LC connectors and MT uh, connectors uh, and, and a variety of uh, crossover cables. And then the last thing I'd like to highlight is a line card. Again, this is a, a, a mock-up demo, but this is kind of building on, on our other midboard demo. And the idea is this, this is a line card where the ASIC might be back uh, in the middle of the plane and the electrical connections would be made to a midboard optical module that does the optical to electrical conversion and that is routed back out to um, a, an optical backplane connector. This particular connector is, is uh, blind mate compatible. Again, it's based on the TELME connector um, and what you can see here is this is a, uh, a mechanical connection that does the course alignment. The final alignment is done with the pins on the, the TELME ferrules and you can it's hard to see here, but there's actually four different um, lines here where the ferrules are loaded. The, the tell me ferrules are loaded. The uh, the Z tension is provided by the serpentine springs in the ferrule itself, and so that allows for a uh, optical backplane connection. Um, and the tell me 
uh, ferals are, are, are dust insensitive. So that's key to that to, to the Tell Me technology, and that's what allows for connections to optical backplanes. So from DesignCon, I'm Matt Davis. Thank you for watching. For more information, please see the links below. Thank you.